All right, so it started with just the bare structure here, like the, the big big foot here, and mm -hmm. he rules the underwater world. He was there, and the buildings were there. Um, and the, the, this base color was here, like the, the wash, they did the wash. Um, so it was created, inspired by drawings from um, kindergarten all the way up through 12th graders um, that were played uh, Flaming Lips songs. That's they even awesome. Did lyrics, lyric yeah, yeah they, they also did lyric, lyric analysis. Finding themes. <laughs> so, so then, after the kids kind of brainstormed based on the music, then the, the story was created. And the story is that uh, King Bigfoot is, uh, is in charge of the underwater world. So this is the underwater world. And it's being invaded by robots and aliens and robot aliens. And That's then there are awesome. some heroes that are rising up from the underground world to fight against those people, so, or against the villains. So we had an artist in residence that worked with us to do the bare outline of it. And then we brought the panel pieces here. And then community members planned out a piece that they wanted to put on here and put it on and made either a, a robot or an alien or an underwater creature. And that is the product, the end result. We were thinking the only way we could outdo the Flaming Lips is if we had like a maxi pad cannon. Just <laughs> and you could just step on them. If you feel like you're having a bad reaction to our strobe lights, <laughs> All you have to do is not look at them. Okay? I know it seems so simple that I must be wrong, but believe me, that's all it takes. If you feel like, fuck, that is fucking with me, just, just listen for a little while, don't look. And we use them often enough, but you'll, you'll get through it. Um, next thing, I'm going to be coming out in my space bubble. The ground is soggy and, you know, footing is already sort of shitty and so I don't want you to rush and crush each other. I'll make my way as best I can. Yes. All you have to do is hold me up and I'll go around and I know it's tempting to want to touch that amazing, <laughs> that amazing bubble. So let's take care of each other because it's slippery out there. And if a couple of people fall, then a couple other people fall. And we don't want that. We want everybody to have as much fucking enthusiasm and fun without any pain. So anyway, thank you guys for being at this great festival. Um, give us just a couple more minutes and we'll fucking start. All right, bye.
Welcome, Olympics. <laughs>